a lot of people have been wondering, like, you know, what you've been up to, and they've been, you know, sending their prayers out and everything. What do you have to say to those people just, like, thinking that you're up to whatever it is? Like, what do you have to say to them? You say prayers and think about me? Really? Well, thank you. Wendy Williams speaks out amid reports about her mental well-being. We've got a lot to talk about. On Wednesday, the 57-year-old talk show host shared a lengthy message to Instagram, seemingly filmed by her son, Kevin Hunter Jr., during a walk on the beach in Florida. Hey, Mom, how you doing? Hi. So everyone's praying about you. Thank you. I'm sure that you're coming back strong. Uh, excuse me. I am going back stronger. When Kevin mentions to her that her fans are worried about her health, the daytime TV personality insists there's no reason to be concerned. When 56 years old, uh, there are things that happen to people. You gotta I, let them know. I would say things usually start about 40 and they go up from there. Like I want to be all I can be and then get back to New York and get on down with the Wendy Williams show. Of course, this all comes amid the TV personality's battle with her bank over control of her fortune. Last week, Wendy fired back at Wells Fargo, strenuously denying claims she is struggling with her mental health after the bank alleged she is an incapacitated person who needs a guardianship. ET spoke with attorney Mitra Ahurian, who does not rep either party. They had some concerns over her ability to make financial decisions and they froze all her assets. So she cannot do the simplest things like pay her bills. They really need evidence that she is of unsound mind. So what's going on with Wendy? Well, it's unclear. But we do know the talk show host took a hiatus in 2019 to deal with addiction issues. And in 2017, she fainted live on the air after having a hot flash, but returned minutes later to finish the show. <gasps> Fast forward to late 2021, and a string of guest hosts have been filling in for the past seven months after the show initially delayed the season 13 premiere. First revealing Wendy tested positive for COVID-19, then announcing she was struggling with health issues due to her Graves disease and her thyroid disorder. My thyroid, my hyperthyroid, is attached also to Graves disease. Graves disease squeezes the muscles behind your eyeballs. I feel like they're birds swimming around my head. You know, like a cartoon? <laughs> like, constantly high, but not high. At the time, the show posted a statement to Instagram revealing that while Wendy was, quote, making progress, she was still, quote, experiencing serious complications. Now, Wendy's attorney says holistic professionals have been helping during treatment for her conditions. Adding, quote, Wendy wants you to know she is fine. She is of sound mind. I said, what? <laughs> what? As for that guardianship, well, time will tell if it's necessary. The process of guardianship requires evidence. It requires proof. It requires probing into someone's capacity, which is not a decision that should be made lightly. So we can expect something like this to take several months. 